Hey folks, it's Mr. Parsons here to explain today's assignment, The American Dream, Pick 2. We recently read six class readings on The American Dream. And we also studied a literary concept for this unit, which is text evidence. Now it's time to combine those two ideas and get a little bit creative with today's assignment, The American Dream, Pick 2. You'll find this assignment under week three in Google Classroom. When you open the assignment, you're given the following instructions. One, open each option. There are five options for you to choose from. Afterwards, you're to pick the two that appeal to you the most and complete the assignment for that option. Then, once all of that work is complete, you're to fill out this Google Form self-reflection Think about the work that you've completed. And then finally, you're going to turn the whole assignment in and take the classroom. So let's take a look at one of these options and see what the kind of work for this assignment will be. I'm going to click on option one. For all the options, you're going to see the instructions are clearly laid out at the beginning of the assignment. For this assignment, there are a series of tables on the left. And my job is to choose four of the tables to add my thinking to. Once a table is full, it's closed, and I have to move on to another table. So I'm going to scroll down and find one that I can respond to. This is a quote from the text, What to the Slave is the Fourth of July? A thin veil to cover up crimes which will disgrace a nation of savages. What emotions Douglas experiencing in the sentence, and what words are communicating? I would write the answer to that question in this box. Then it says, does our country need to remember our past or forget it? Why? I would write the answer to that question in this box. And then finally, I would write my name and my class period here. After that, I've completed one table. And as you can see at the top, I need to choose four tables to add to my response to get credit for option one. Once again, five options, and you can work on whichever two fit your learning style the best. Once you're done, fill out the self-reflection and turn the assignment in. I can't wait to see the creative things that you come up with on this assignment. And let me know if you have any questions about the American Dream, pick two.